What's up, y'all? What's up with it? Shout out to the WTC family. We the chosen ones, y'all. Y'all know where we at, right? <laughs> Hope y'all having a blessed day, man. Beautiful day, man. We at the mother beach. Look at that, y'all. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful. And y'all tripping off of people. Beautiful. Come on now. Let me tell y'all. They're aggravated. Everybody is aggravated because of your glow. Never dim your light to feel sorry for people who are miserable with themselves. Glow anyway. Understand what I'm saying? Everybody's aggravated because of your glow. I'm telling you, it's getting real out here, y'all. Y'all better pay attention to the signs. Everybody getting mad and, you know, having different attitudes. and You know how it is. Uh, different spirits be facing on a daily basis. But let me tell you something. You have to get by yourself. and You really have to get focused because everywhere you go, everybody's going to be mad because of your glow. Everybody. But don't worry about it. Because guess what? They're miserable with themselves. <laughs> I'm at the beach, chilling. Smoking a good blunt, chilling. What's up with y'all? Shout out to the WTC family. We the chosen ones, man. Y'all need to get by yourself and appreciate what God is doing for y'all. Half of y'all people don't even look like what y'all been through. And you think people gonna like you? Come on, man. Understand what I'm saying? We're living in our last and evil days. Pay attention to the signs, man. Everybody is aggravated. Everybody is upset. Everybody is mad. For what? For no reason. But it's really because of your glow. You shining bright like a diamond. And people can't stand you. But guess what? Don't dim your light. Understand what I'm saying? Don't dim your light. Don't, don't bring your energy down. Understand what I'm saying? Don't bring your vibration from being all the way to the top sky to, to come all the way back down. Because I'm going to tell you something. Don't change for nobody. I'm telling you, just keep shining bright. Shine bright like a diamond. God's got a plan. He got a vision. Understand what I'm saying? We're going to newer, newer heights. Y'all look at this. Check this out. We at the beach, baby. What's good with it, y'all? <laughs> God is good, man. God is good. Shout out to the WTC family, man. We the chosen ones, y'all. We going to newer levels up in here, y'all. Look, check this out. Check this out. Beautiful. Y'all worrying about people. Y'all better get out here and enjoy life. Beautiful. Don't tell me what God won't do. Look at the waves and shit. Y'all worrying about people. They aggravated because guess what? It's the glow. God is shining bright on your life. Like, think about it. God is doing some really, really great things in the we the chosen one's life. And guess what? They can't stand to see us coming because guess what? Our light is too bright. You have to understand who sent you. You have to know your worth. Not only know your worth, but also pay it forward. Understand what I'm saying? See, when you're living for God, everything is beautiful now. Wow, this is amazing. Look at this right here, y'all. Look at that sunset on that on that wave right there. Look at that. Look at that light shining bright. Right there. Look at that, y'all. Y'all see it? Right there. Look how beautiful that is. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. Look at that, y'all. Y'all better live your life. <laughs> you better live your life. You feel me? Beautiful. Life is good. I'm saying, but back to what I was saying, you know, thank God that you don't look like what you've been through. You know, there's a lot of people out here that's really, you know, really going through it, but thank God you don't look like what you've been through. You know what I'm saying? Trouble don't last always, but keep the faith. Don't give up. It's going to be all right. Because you're walking in the light. Understand what I'm saying? I'm living life. I'm not tripping. They're doing some construction on this house right here. Understand, understand. They're trying to get it together. Look, look at that. That's my new house right there, getting worked on. Claiming in Jesus' name. That's nice. They're doing some construction right there. But look, now we're getting closer to it. Look. Ooh, wee. Now that's beautiful. 
That is amazing. Wow. Let's get closer on that. Come on now. We got to get closer because we already know the Decepticons is coming. We know that. The, look. So guess what, what you got to do? You got to move locations. But let's get closer. Let's get closer. Look, check this out. The Decepticons are coming. But look at that. Look at God. Look at that. That's beautiful. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Look at that. Wow. That is amazing. And y'all tripping off of people. Come on, man. You know, I have to move locations. You got to move. You can't be around everybody. You know what I'm saying? See how I just moved that fast? Got closer to the water? Because <laughs> I already been to the water. And I already been baptized. Hey, yeah. Don't get me started. Y'all know how I do it, man. Look. God is doing some amazing things in our life, y'all. And everybody's upset because think about it. We are going through the COVID-19. A lot of people don't really want to be working right now. I probably She probably was having a bad day. But guess what? I'm going to tell you what happened today. I went out to eat. Listen. Look. Check this out. My blunt going out. Hold on. Let me spark him up. Let me spark him up. You know I like to talk blowing the bleasy. You know me. I'm just keeping it real. Hold on real quick, y'all. I'm going to be myself, but... I'm going to still, you know, spit some facts to y'all. Check this out. Get this lighter. Devil ain't going to stop my video today. You understand what I'm saying? It's crazy how many distractions you get when you're making a video, motivational video. Everybody want to know what you're talking about. But this ain't for everybody ears. Listen. Hold on, hold on. Let me fuck you. Hold on. All right, we back in business. I went out to eat today. And uh, I had a good time. The food was pretty good. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, the atmosphere is pretty chill, but I'm going to keep it real, man. You know, lady, she works there. But you can tell she don't like her job. Come on now. That's what I'm telling you about these nine to fives. The different spirits that be in these nine to fives. Y'all got to pay attention, man. They be going through it up in there. But I was never like that because I'm, all, I'm the chosen one. Even when I was working the nine to five, I always had a, a positive attitude. I always dressed accordingly. Always had the fresh cut. Always showed respect. You feel me? There's levels to this. You know what I'm saying? So check this out. I went out to eat. You know me. I got to get my steak and eggs. You know what I'm saying? I had steak and eggs, and I had the loaded baked potato. Filled me with the orange juice. Y'all know me. I like to eat. But check this out. So when I was out, you know the lady was very, very disrespectful, very rude. How may I help you? You know, when I walked in, it was, you know, may I have a table for one? And it's crazy how, this is how you know when you are the chosen one. When you go in saying, I need a table for one. <laughs> what they do that at? Huh? You feel me? Look, you know you the chosen one when you got to ask, may I have a table for one? Let me tell y'all something. Check this out, man. So when I went in, I asked for a table for one. Very disrespectful. Very rude. Very rude. But you know one thing? I didn't let it bother me. I said, yes, ma'am. I'm here, you know, by myself. I just want to come and eat. Follow me. You know what I mean? I'm very calm and pleasant. At first, she was like, I can't hear you. But, I, I you know, I, I'm not very soft-spoken. But when I just got through finished praying, you know, I'm already in a, in a great spirit. I don't need no negativity around me. That's why you can't hang out with everybody. These spirits will jump on you. If you ain't careful. Come on, we're going to go ahead and make a U-turn. So like we're going over by these houses over here. But like I said, you got to be very careful because guess what? The spirits will jump on you. Understand what I'm saying? So that's why you got to be covered. Covered in the blood, filled with the Holy Ghost. We're going to make a U-turn right here. Understand what I'm saying? So long story short, as I sat down, I ate. The food was really, really great, delicious. You know me? I got to get my porterhouse steak and eggs. Understand what I'm saying? So, by the time I end up going to pay for the food, right, the guy gave me too much money back. I gave the guy 30 bucks. The food was $26 or some change. He gave me back $13. So, maybe he thought I gave him two 20s, but I know what I gave him. I gave him uh, a 20 and a 10. So, I looked at it and I'm like, man, you gave me too much money. But when I went back to the lady... She really, really had a bad attitude. 
And what I wanted to say is, I said, calm down, man, calm down. I said, I only came back because your brother gave me 10 extra dollars more than what I was supposed to get. Let me tell you something. Do not block your blessings by doing wrong and knowing that, hey, this brother gave me too much money. You know what I mean? Stuff like that. That will block your blessings, man. It pays to live right, y'all. So I went back and I gave the brother back the $10, man, because come on now, you know right from wrong. And especially when God is moving in your life, guess what? You already know the devil going to try to come and do some slick stuff. But I caught that. I said, this man giving me back too much money. So God will move on the hearts of his people to do the right thing. You can't tell me my God ain't good. So the lady was like, oh, I'm sorry about that. But you all yelling at me being disrespectful. I'm only coming back to give y'all some money back so y'all can keep y'all business booming. You, you feel me? So, like a long story short, I'm just saying, just be the example, man. Don't adapt to the energy that's in there because them people are miserable. That's what I'm saying. Do not dim your light to feel sorry for other people's miserableness. These people are sad and... You know what I'm saying? I need everybody to come to 11. 11, baby. As we're just passing. Hold on. Mm -hmm. To the beach real quick. Everybody come to 11. 11, look at this. Go to the beach and walk around. New beginnings, y'all. Look at this. Go to the beach and just walk. It'll give you a different perspective of life. Look at this. New beginnings. Look at that. Come on. You know God is with us at all times right there. Look at that. Look at that sun. God is always with me, so I won't be tripping. He's omnipresent. He's everywhere at the same time, y'all. Know this. Look at that. And y'all tripping off of people. Look at that wave. Oh, they got a wave. Look at that wave going up. We'll get closer to the water. But let me tell y'all something. Life is amazing, man. I'm about to get closer to the waves. Watch. That's when you know you're really living. I can do it today. Make a video and go by the water just to show y'all how it feels to be free. It's not worrying about the dollar bill. God going to provide that. You understand what I'm saying? He going to give that to you. So what I want to say is, you know, never, never dim your light. You know what I mean? You know, to feel sorry for other people and their miserableness. You know, people are miserable nowadays. You know, you shining bright like a diamond. They can't stand that. They already don't want to see you win. But it's all right, though. Because if God is for us, who can be against us, y'all? I don't know if y'all can really see me. You know what I mean? But I'm glowing, so I guess you can see me either way. We'll switch it back. We'll switch it on back. Okay, that's better. Right there. Now I can see my skin glowing a little bit. What's up with y'all? I hope everybody having a blessed day. Get ready for the new retreat. Get ready for the retreat. The first retreat of this year, baby. To the WTC family. We the chosen ones, baby. This is about to be the retreat of the year, man. Y'all about to be ready. Because once y'all meet me, y'all going to know what energy is about. I understand, I understand. You feel me? So look, check this out. Do not be afraid to join the WTC mentor Mentoring Program. My email is Jordan underscore Howard 18 at yahoo.com. Any prayer requests, any testimonies, you already know what to do. So if you really want to get to the next level, guess what? I got you. Don't even sweat it. <laughs> I got the key to the success, man. Trust me. Trust me. Any testimonies, any prayer requests, I read each and every email. Each and every email I read, I take my time and go through them because I know what God did in my life. And once I read that email, I already know what God is going to do for you, man. You know what I'm saying? Just a gift from God. And we just give God all the glory, honor, and praise because if it had not been for him, we wouldn't be enjoying this right here. Major, Look at that. So you mean to tell me he created the heavens and the earth in seven days? Ain't that crazy? <laughs> Come on now. Ain't that crazy? In seven days, this man did this. I believe it, man. That man is awesome. That man is awesome, man. Life is good, y'all. Never dim your light. Keep shining bright, man. You know what I mean? Keep on shining bright. Everybody don't want to see you shining bright. They want to see you miserable. They want to see you lost. They want to know who you are, what you're about. You know what I mean? What are you doing? Just know that God sent me. Learn how to be humble, y'all. Look, God sent me here. How are you? God bless you.
You ain't never got to stoop down to other people's level because they're miserable. That's what I'm saying. Never dim your light. You shine so bright. You have to set the example. Everybody watching. I need everybody. Come on, WTC game. Back me up. I need everybody to subscribe to my channel. I need everybody to like this video. And guess what? We the chosen ones, baby. You already know, man. Y'all be blessed. Hang on in there, man. Hang on in there. If you guys want to really support the movement, man. Understand what I'm saying? If you guys really want to support the movement, Cash App is dollar sign. God will provide three zero. You already know what it is. PayPal is uh, God will provide uh, three zero for sure. Amen, brother. Oh, you know it. God bless you, man. You know it, man. So look, check this out, man. God will provide. God will provide. See, he felt the energy. I know he will provide. So if you guys want to be a blessing, understand what I'm saying? Support the movement. I just said God will provide. He said amen, brother. That lets you know right there. How are you? Good, good, yeah. But check this out, man. Look at that dream house I was talking about. Oh, there you go. Okay, there you go. Dream house. I'm claiming it is mine. In Jesus' name. But like I said, shout out to the WTC family. We the chosen ones. You guys already know what it is. You guys be encouraged. And guess what, baby? Don't be afraid to hit your boy up. Join the WTC mentoring program and you will get to the next level. Understand what I'm saying? So just know that if you need a friend, you got it in me. You know, if you need prayer, you know you got a prayer warrior in me. If you need motivation, if you need inspiration, you already know you got the best motivational speaker in the whole wide world. In your boy. Because we are the chosen ones. Be blessed.